He's just running late. He's always late. But what on earth is keeping him? Mr. Groom, the wedding is starting. Are you ready? <gasps> You're not even dressed. Make yourself presentable. She's waiting for you. over there? You look so handsome.
Sleepyhead. What kind of babies would a blue jay in a cardinal make? What a cute purple one! Your mustache is getting long again. Might need a trim soon. While you're waiting on your coffee, could you bring Stacy some milk? Soon I'll be a hundred feet tall. My typewriter is out of ink. We've got more somewhere, right? basement flooded. You've spent so much more time with us lately. I made your coffee just the way you like it. Sea salt and tartar sauce. Now that you're energized, I need you to take care of some chores in the backyard while I get some work done. There's grass to mow, weeds to pull, wood to chop, and don't forget to make burgers for lunch. from the table. Come here, honey. Let me take a look. If this thing were any bigger, I'd be dead. Be careful, Dad. Don't mess up my collectibles. Tommy, why do you have so many footballs? They're all different and, like, special or something. Oh, now I get it. What? They're like dollies. Some are for playing house and some are for playing space dolly, and some... No, they're not. They're not like that. I think some of my army men are still buried there. Rest their souls. <laughs> of course I had to. Do you want their bodies lying all over the house? Beautiful day today. The sun is shining, the birds are singing, the worms are wiggling. Dad, our hamburgers yes. really made out of the hams worms are happy to be from outside the today. Hmm? Oh, what if they were made from ponies? <gasps> My camera's getting a bit old, honey. Any chance you know where to find an M1 modified for motor drives? We'll just see about that. <laughs> Don't get too comfortable, dear. I've got a busy day planned for the whole family. <laughs> and make a wish. Sometimes I wish I could be purple. No! <gasps> oh, oh, my well, flowers! Wishes, real wishes, Stacy. Everyone knows that. <laughs> the ladybugs are really getting out of hand this season. 
I should pick up some insecticide before they eat all my flowers. Up in your brother's drink. I'm just trying to make a potion. Well, dear, I've got a book on chemistry that'll teach you to make real potions. Well, my potion's already real. Well, I would mow the lawn, but I hurt my knee at basketball practice and my elbow at baseball and my foot at. Dad, the way you're mowing the lawn reminds me of this one episode of Sports Johnson where he goes back in time and meets his son, Sports Johnson Jr., or SJJ. And me and his son have to train to win the future soccer match between Earth and Pluto. And they do. And Dad, are we ever going to play soccer together? over there. think aquariums are festering prisons of iniquity, but I've got to write an article for the paper. Can't you make an exception this time? For me? Hmm. Oh, uh, groceries. We need to go to the grocery store. We need things like cereal for the kids. Right, kids? Well, we already have cereal. We need so much cereal. Then it's settled. We're all going to the grocery store. I want Sports Johnson cereal and pizza and soda and chocolate milk. And I want an apple. Ugh. <laughs> Gervison's has revolutionized the modern shopping experience. Everything here is automated and handled remotely. Thank you. 
Destroy! Destroy! Hear that? Abazor action figures are back in stock by popular demand. We here at Gervison's promote family values by offering great values to great families. I choose Gervison's because I can't get enough of Soda City. I wish I lived in Soda City. Our freezer section is all frozen up. We're working on getting it fixed, but we're sure at least one freezer door is working. Why are all these freezers frozen? See, when the red light's on, the speaker is off. That means it's safe for me to talk about how we get our meat from... What? What is it? Oh, jeez! Uh, what I was saying was, it's safe to talk about how we get our meat from... Nowhere! Gervison's. This milk says it's packed with vitamin... G? Hmm? 
picking up soda for the big game, maybe for a big party? Only Gervison's has a soda city big enough to handle all your biggest events. Nasta soda is out of this world. Our deli offers a variety of creatures that can be fried, barbecued, roasted, and toasted. <laughs> Stop on by. Hey, but get away from me. Three sushi samples in the back. They are delicious. Moderately priced sushi. <laughs> 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 Now that we've got our groceries, it's time to head to the aquarium! Yay! Well, that makes two of us. To the car, kids! Yay! Yay! I want to see a snuggle fish! I want to climb something condemned! Honey, it's really simple. You can come to the aquarium with your family, or you can walk home alone. Oh. 
<laughs> Honey, are you all right? What has got you so spooked? <laughs> <sighs> okay, I'll just have to add that to the list of questions. Don't worry, we're here for you. Now, let's get some tickets. Thank you for visiting the Curry Aquatic Fun Center. Hey, get back in line! Have a whale of a time. Something smells fishy. You always say that. going down the tubes. Oh, if there's anybody out there, tell my wife I won't be home for dinner. Oh, or breakfast.
Trust free sushi. about kelp. Oh man, look at all this learning. Come on, Dad. Let's get through all this junk so we can get out of here. The world of kelp. Travel the world of kelp. Mario sisters. Lunia, grab that big globe and I'll get the quiz going. Dad, Laminaria is yellow. Hurry, hit all three. Spin the earth as hard as you can! Bacosystis is purple! Hurry, Dad! We need to get the best time!
We hope you've enjoyed your journey around the world of kelp. This is for your own good. to reproduce. Get a male and female spore yeah. into each safe floor Just soil pot. the spores into the soil pots. <laughs> Are there more kelp than people on Earth? <laughs> yeah. the gas-filled bladders that help kelp float. Touch the top of the kelp to find out. Oh, Find out. Oh man, this is just like that episode of Sports Johnson where he's trapped on the screen and has to learn how to finger skate. I thought it was a really episode. Hurry up, Dad! This help isn't gonna learn itself! eat kelp and otters eat sea urchins use the otter to save kelp from <laughs> urchin extinction just try and protect those kelp dad Come on, Dad. 
Dad, where do you think of gravity? Did you grow up on the moon? donating or buying kelp merchandise on your way out. Well, we're alone without the kids for once. Honey, we should really talk. <laughs> Someday I'll be strong enough to pull this snake. I wonder what our lives will be like once our kids grow up and move away. Maybe we'll finally have mm -hmm. time to travel. The aquarium was more educational. them off like they're nothing. Like when your foot got caught in the ceiling fan, or when we ran out of printer ink and you just made more. And I keep buying you toothbrushes and then finding them in the trash. There 
was that time you were fixing the sink and the disposal came on? But you wouldn't go to the hospital, yet somehow your arm looks good as new. Are you ever going to explain that? Looks like the rainforests are being cut down. I guess nothing lasts forever, huh? seem to hate the aquarium. Hmm. <laughs> I don't think turtles can really do that. We were taking that cake decorating class. After that bakery burned down, I had a lot of questions to answer. Stacy would be so happy if she could see you. You know, she thinks you hate dolphins.
so talkative, but when we're talking about us, you clam up. Aren't these endangered? They hey, that guy's I cheating. Tank has sprung a leak. My hands are full. Why don't you try to fix that instead? Here, use these. I don't want them in. Honey, be careful. I've got work to do. Can you feel like having a real discussion? Find me at the Shark Tank. You can beat old Air Hockey Matt at his own game, huh? Bring it. How did you beat me? I've been 
training for so long. You are now entering the deep ocean, home to many strange and mysterious creatures. Bear witness to their world of... Predators seek out the phosphorescent glow of their prey. Do you have what it takes to hunt in the darkness? I bet you don't. Dad, if I get lost in here, come find me. Good dancing, Dad. I tried to dance like you and hit my head. And went to sleep. So, if you were a bigger fish, you would catch the smaller fish and then raise them to be big fish, right? Congratulations, Hunter. You have what it takes. Now take a shake I light and be. descend. Jellyfish can live forever, can you?
Sometimes I dream about swimming in the ocean and hearing something calling from deep below, calling me towards it. It turns out to be a seahorse ramp. Dang it. Why is it so dark down here? Did a fuse blow? Oh no! That is one of those science men that you're afraid of! Give me the shaky light! Thanks, Dad. Excuse me, little girl. That was the majestic hall of jellyfish. Were you entranced? I bet you were. Witness the amazingly cuddly Snugglefish. A stuffed Snugglefish toy makes a killer gift. <laughs> oh, he isn't me. That's misunderstood. This fish makes a plush toy that is to die for. So cute you'll say, I want to eat you up.
Thank you for visiting the deep ocean. Were you undelighted? I bet you weren't. Family, the bad news. Why is the boat stopped? Where's the captain? You know him, probably taking a shower. In the middle of a rainstorm? Keeps me up that extra 17 hours. Hmm. Hey, where'd my coffee go? sails on this boat? I guess we should be called engine boat. That's a terrible thing. Our net profits went up. Good one. 
What? Net profit? I don't because because we're fishing. <laughs> Watch out, it's slippery out here. I hope I don't see any octopuses. What? I just... I just hate them. So much. And she says, well, are you a girl or a boy? <laughs> <laughs> Ninety-nine bottles of grog on the wall, Bob. Ninety-nine bottles of grog, Bob. What? We've come a long way from that. It's not stereotype or something. Yeah. I'm sorry. That's fine. Hey, new guy. You aren't going anywhere till the deck is swabbed and the anchor's hoisted. Two days, friend. We cannot see it. Two days. Shower. Can you get to the helm and get us out of this storm? <laughs> I 
thought I saw somebody sneaking around the front of the boat. It could be my eyes playing tricks on this pain. The captain's back, thank goodness. Start the boat, Captain. Hurry. <laughs> That new cook on board? I heard he's a real piece of work. I asked him for seconds and he threw a pineapple at me. Well, I asked him for pineapples and he kicked me in the stomach. Sometimes I wish I became a maritime lawyer. Ever-flowing beard of clam. Just me, or did the captain seem jiggly? Stowing away, please don't throw me overboard. Really? Well, now we're both in trouble. Who are you then? <laughs> Aren't we a pair? Say, he's the octopus. Here? That's Chef. He's been watching for stowaways the whole voyage. Something is different about you, Captain. Hmm. If you really are the Captain, then dance the Captain's Jig! Wow! Such movement! A fine jig. But can you tie a sheep shank knot? <laughs> what kind of knot is this? You are not the captain. You are not even human! Hey, big guy. Yeah, you! What? Who are you? Stoy? Wait! Before you kick me off, can I ask you some questions about the war? Oh, oh. Well, since you asked, I have some strong opinions! <laughs> Let me stop.
was a close one. I hope that man is okay. All right, all right. So what about you, mystery man? Who are you? Well, someday I'll get an answer out of you. In the meantime, would you care for a dance? Kids, have you seen your father? It's almost closing time. Where could he be? No, no, I saw him go in a weird door. Another mystery. Well, we'll wait as long as we can. Excuse me, ma'am? It's that weirdo! I have bad news about your husband. Don't trust him! Have we met? Wait. I've seen you. Are you an old friend of my husband's? What can you tell me about him? Everything! You must come with me to cafeteria! Come on, Stacy. What? Wait! Oh, <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
wants to go through the lost and found. Me, me, I do. I could use a new watch. I saw an octopus zooming around the tanks earlier. You're hallucinating. There hasn't been an octopus in this place since the incident. The incident? You just forgot to lock the up. While you're in there, do you mind unclogging the toilet? something coming from the break room? Eh, it's probably just Joe. Go in there and make sure he's all right. Holy shit! <laughs> Oh, 
simulator. Unbelievable. He makes this huge mess, then splits. Hey, give Joe a break. He probably had to get home to his wife and kids. Ah, the day is done. Time to head home. Alone. Like always. <laughs> I guess I'll have another TV dinner. Probably fish sticks. Again. You don't have what it takes to fill my shoes. I'm wet! What are you doing? Do I have to come down there and show you how it's done? The deep sea exhibit gives me the willies. That guy really loves his job. Jeez, some people... What's the matter, Bob? Someone went through all the exhibits and trashed the place. We'll have to order more carp. You're so clumsy. Do you have butterfish fingers? Mm. But if we introduce this new squid... I know you're in that tank somewhere, Leafy Sea Dragon. You can't hide forever. I will expose you, Leafy Sea Dragon. Mm, but would the food chain be disrupted? Ah. On the count of three. One, two, wait. My shoe's untied. No, it's not. There's just a garden eel on your foot. Well, would you look at that? Okay, ready. No. Wait. What is it now? My garden eel's untied. I guess sharks can't stop moving. Am I right, Joe? No, Leafy Sea Dragon! You are my only friend! That new cafeteria chef was screaming at everyone to leave. He is a strange, strange man. Yes. Have you ever tried asking him for pie, people? That's it! I'm coming down there! My biologist's sense is tingling. Ew. No one wants to hear that. Do you hear that? Sounds like fish slapping against the floor. Can't you see I'm busy? I wish the Amazon Arcade was more educational. Well, I wish I didn't have to answer, how do fish breathe a million times a day? How do fish breathe? I'm going to throw you in the shark tank.
No, no, no! You not get it! He was Octopus! Let me go! That doesn't make any sense. How would he even walk on land? I'll call the police! He just does! I'm not crazy! Clearly. I guess you don't know anything after all. Well then, we're leaving. It's past the kids' bedtimes. You're not leaving until you understand! It's an, it's an octopus! It's Dad! Nobody else knew? You see? He is octopus! I'm not crazy! Awesome! Just because you're right doesn't mean you're not crazy. This explains so much. You have them beguiled, octopus. But I still cut you down! <laughs> Fried octopus coming up! Fire is opposite of water, octopus! Run like a pony, Dad! Fire, the smoke, it is the war all over again! We've got to help the kids. Hurry, honey. I'll give you a boost. <laughs> Stacy is on the other end of the cafeteria. Be careful up there. Step lightly, Octopus. It will not matter. You will fail! Careful, honey. Steady. Steady.
Honey, over here. Come on, baby. Take this. There you are. He belongs in the ocean, not in a suit. I will serve you, this Can I find you? Yes! I will find you. Get away from him, you brute. Great. You should have stayed in the tank, Octopus. Do we love powers by any? The pressure is increasing. Just one more. What, is that what are you doing, Octopus? No! This thing is gonna blow! For the war? Your family really loves you, Octopus. I not bother you again. Honey? So, this news will take some getting used to. But I was imagining much worse. But next time, Tell me ten years earlier. Wait a second. If that is an octopus, then where did me and Stacy come from? <laughs> Seriously. The lead actor is dreamy. Is that really his name? Who would name someone that? Who's that man? The book was better. With the flowers in his hand. Oh. Who's that man? I think this thing is jump for shot. The sets were so realistic. <laughs>
always stay for the secret ending. Welcome, sir. What name is your reservation under? Hmm. I don't see a brrrr on the list. Perhaps I'd see more clearly if I had a little bribe. We have a table for two after all. Right this way. I love how salty the food is here. Your waiter will be with you shortly. So good. Coming! Oh, hold on, don't decide yet. I want to try ordering mm. for both of us. Let's see if I've got you figured out yet. <laughs> oh. You'll find out. Good evening. I'll be taking care of you tonight. Are we ready to order? Yes. I'd like the sirloin, and he'd like the halibut. Excellent choice. Thank you. Did I get it? <laughs> See? You're not so mysterious after all. Hey, we should toast. <laughs> you know, clink glasses together, wish something well. Have you not toasted before? <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> okay, hurry back. <laughs> oh. Hmm? 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 
excuse me? What the heck, little guy? Go help out in the kitchen while we clean up after you. Very busy tonight. Crush those grapes as you would your sworn enemies! Good amount to tip. Zero percent? There you are. I was beginning to wonder if you'd fallen in. Oh, mm. how sweet. Mm. But isn't that the waiter's job? Bon appétit. Well, don't just sit there. Let's talk. <laughs> Still playing the strong silent type, eh? Don't worry, I've got some icebreakers. Like, what's your favorite book? <laughs> Salty Hearts? <laughs> I didn't take you for the romance novel type. <laughs> Hey, lover boy, take care of the other customers before you get your flirt on. Yes, we'd like to share a pizza. Hurry back. <laughs> Hmm? 
You're a little wet behind the ears to be waiting tables, but what the heck? Let's see what you've got. Oh, that's good, thank you. More? Wow. A little more? Mm. Enough! Not bad, but let's see you serve mm. that fancy cake to the table near the entrance. Like our marriage used to be. <sighs> the waiters have purple stains all over their shoes. I should investigate that. Bon appetit. So, what's the most haunted place you've ever been? <laughs> really? <laughs> Submarine ghosts? Jeff was looking for you. Back to cooking, young apprentice. I smell an octopus. It must be done cooking. Meat is still moving. It is not tender enough. The art 
of gold tossing requires a surgeon's precision and delicacy. Oh, you're not the only one with secrets. I've been doing some digging in Nevada. Enjoy. It's aliens. All of it. If you could be any kind of animal. Human? <laughs> That's a silly answer. Natural. A true artist. Watch and learn, boys. Watch and learn. Mm-hmm. 
Enjoy. Oh, if I had to choose, I think I'd pick Venice. Something about the waterways feels so romantic, like a union of land and sea. Mm. Have I mentioned how much I like your accent? Ah, there's the rookie. The chef needs more help in the kitchen. for a taste. It's pretty good, isn't it? Um, Tommy, what's this story about? Well, this is a story about Dad. And he's in a wrestling ring. Mm, I think he's at the hospital. And he's a nurse. Uh, that's lame. Why can't he be a doctor? No, he's a nurse and he does nursey things. Fine. So he goes to the nurse station. Oh.
And Dad met this one guy who was a jerk. Well, it's about time. My bottom hurts. Adjust my bed, nurse. Melon slices aren't just gonna jump into my mouth. Round, round. Mm. 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 Oh, I'm bored. Give me a book. Slow. Change it already. Here, mm -hmm. I'm sick of your face. And then Dad met a patient who was sad and weird. It's bad, isn't it? Oh no! Oh no! Is it Chaz? Luforia? The Macarena? You better check my blood pressure to find out. I'm not blinking enough. Mm -hmm. oh, what is it? Oh, give it to me straight, nurse. Uh, can you show me on the whiteboard? Oh, well, that's not so bad. Thanks, nurse. Away! As everyone knows, people afflicted with unicornitis can fly. And Dad met this one lady who was really nice. Good morning, Mr. Nurse. If it's not too much trouble, would you mind fluffing my pillow and turning off the television?
the waiting room, please. Here's some money to buy them. is Dad's long-lost brother. Dad, it's your long-lost brother. I've got terrible news for you. One of your patients is going into cardiac arrest. Patient alert in room 205. One of those hospital-y things they say on TV. It hmm. sounds illegal. <laughs> Suddenly, Dad faced a most fearsome challenge. A door! Good thing there was a crowbar there to crowbar the door open! Mm-hmm. 
Ugh. Try again. In a box somewhere?
robot anymore. But, uh, but Dad got Unicornitis from that alien lady, and the only cure for Unicornitis is jet skis. So he bought us some sweet jet skis! The end. <laughs> 